hello students welcome back to my channel today we are going to talk about crop ecology this is a very important topic from exam perspective whether you are appearing for state pcs or upsc or any agri competitive exam in your state or at national level you can find questions from this section and students generally they cannot appear this type of question because these are uh, unconventional questions uh, i have compiled these notes and if you want you can pause the video pause the lecture at any point and you can note down these points right so let's discuss one by one so what is ecology and this ecology term it it was derived from Greek word oikos, which means house, and logos means to study. So, ecology is a is the study of relationship between plants and animals, whatever organisms, with their environment. What is the relationship between plants and animals, whether whether they are plants, animals, or any organism, with their environment? What is that environment? That may be biotic environment. That may be abiotic environment. Suppose. We are taking an uh, example of any plant. So, what what is the environment of any plant? It has phylosphere, it has rhizosphere, it has root environment, it has you know foliage environment. And in foliage as well as root environment, we have certain biotic factors affecting the plant growth as well as some abiotic factors are there. Like biotic factor means it has life. What are the biotic factors affecting plant growth? These are animal, insect, uh, any pathogen or any other plant, right? What are the abiotic factors like solar radiation, rainfall, temperatures, uh, etc. So these are the abiotic and biotic factors, uh, those affecting that plant or any organism. So it is the ecology is the study of relationship between the, that organism and its surrounding, its environment, right? So what it was derived from Okoi Lozi that is coined by German scientist Ernst Haeckel in 1866 and uh, he, he had written a book that is called generally morphology their organism in 1866 right who is known as the father of indian ecology ramdio misra ramdio misra is known as father of indian ecology who is the fa uh, father of modern ecology that is using odom Eugene Odom, somewhere you can find Eugene Odom and somewhere you can find Hutchinson as the father of modern ecology who is uh, known as the father of animal ecology that is Charles Elton. Charles Elton is known as father of animal ecology. So crop ecology is the study of interrelationship between crop plant and environment. Ecology is the study of uh, study of relationship between organism and its environment. And crop ecology specifically it is study of interrelationship between crop plants and its environment. Crop ecology is of two types. One is autoecology or population ecology. Another is sine ecology or community ecology. What is autoecology or population ecology? It is a study of individual organism or species, okay, between that organism and environment. What is sine ecology or communi community ecology? That is the study of group of organisms of different species associated together as an unit in form of community. That is community into environment. So, what is autoecology? Suppose I am taking uh, the example of you, yourself. Think of yourself as a uh, unit, as an organism and whatever the environmental factor affecting you that relationship is known as autoecology suppose we are living in a community and we have certain plants in our gardens we have certain animals like a dog a cat with us so overall this is considered as a unit and its uh, interrelationship with organism that is known as sine ecology so there are levels of ecology what are the levels of ecology one is individual level, then followed by population level, followed by community level, followed by ecosystem level, followed by biome level, followed by biosphere. So the number of, uh, number of organisms increases here and number of factors area increases here from individual level to biosphere level. So what is individual? That is unit living thing or organism. What is population? That is group of individual organism that live in the same area. Okay, if group of individual organism live in a same area that is known as population. What is community? Population live together in the defined area that is community. What is ecosystem? Community and its non-living surrounding. A community and its non-living surrounding in that community that is known as ecosystem. What is biome? Biome means large geographical region with same plant life and climate. What is biosphere? The part of earth that contains all ecosystem that is biosphere. Right. If we study the dimension of uh, these forms of uh, ecology from atom level, atomic level to biosphere level, 
so this is uh, you can see first is atom atom forms molecule molecule forms macromolecular uh, phospholipid like for example phospholipid lipid then macromolecule constitute a cell it forms cell then cell further integrated and forms tissue that is suppose epithelial tissue or connective tissue like that then tissue forms organs uh, like suppose lungs organ forms organ system like respiratory system circulatory system etc then organ system combines together and forms organism like us then organism combines like population then population forms community community forms ecosystem ecosystem forms biosphere right this was all about ecology in next class we will uh, study ecosystem okay